to my channel. My name's Gabby. If you're new here, if you're not new here, shout out to you because I have not posted in well over a year. So if you're watching this video, I really, really appreciate you. So anyways, you can tell by the title of this video, today's video is going to be a back to school haul. In my final semester of college ever. Yeah, I just had to get a few clothes, a few little pickups, even though half these clothes are definitely not appropriate for school. Um, some of these are like going out clothes because that's what college is about too, going out. So yeah, I got some back to school clothes, going out clothes, chill clothes, all the above. If you guys like this video, please do me a favor, give me a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe, all that. But without further ado, let's get on into this video. I don't know why you guys, but my audio is being so weird. It sounds disgusting when I'm watching back these clips, but whatever. First, I'm gonna start with accessories. I got a whole bunch of accessories that I was just replacing. I have pictures of all the accessories I got actually, but I have a whole bunch here and I feel like that's annoying to go through all of them. I'm wearing one of my rings now. And I used to have this ring before, but I lost it. Constantly losing my jewelry. I repurchased these earrings as well. I literally lost one of them. So I had to repurchase these, but all of my accessories are from Shein, by the way. So first, I'm gonna start with my in-store purchases, so I'll make it easier for myself. The first item I got is this top from H&M. It's unbuttoned because I was trying it on for you guys. It's this button-up jean top from H&M. I'm super late to the trend of the jeans top, but I love it. I've always loved it. I was just so like lazy to buy it for myself. And yeah, this shirt was on sale H&M for like fifteen dollars. I was like. <laughs> Of course, I gotta buy it. It's like a summer staple, so yeah. And next in-store purchase is actually what I'm wearing right now. It's this black spaghetti strap dress. It goes all the way to my ankles. The quality of the dress is very, very nice. This dress is from Forever 21, I believe, and I really, really love it. Yeah, beats an $80 skims dress. It looks the same, so that's all of the purchases I got in-store. So my next item is this brown plunge dress. It's plunged in the front. And the back is completely backless and it has like ruching on your butt, so it makes your butt look big. And this dress is super, super cute. Only thing I find interesting is the color because it's supposed to be brown, but it, it is brown, but it's kind of like black. It's a like teetering the line of black, so it's like brownish black, which I like. Um, it also has a slit on the side. So I'll definitely be wearing this. Next, we got this like champagne color dress it's a cow neck dress so the front is a cow neck and the back is open i don't know why i cannot leave cow neck stuff alone like i feel like it's not meant for my body but when i see it online i think it's the cutest thing ever and i want to buy it like even when i'm not wearing it right now it looks so cute but on it just doesn't do it for me like i was not really a fan too much of this dress it's only cute when i pull it down so you can really see everything. I think that sounds cute. I also like on the side of it, it has like um, strings so you can ruch it up. So I like that. So I'm like, maybe I can make it work, but I don't know. I need to leave cow next up alone. I think I learned my lesson for real this time, but I love the color. So there's that, I like that. And I like the material, it's like a nice material. So yeah. So next up we have this like grayish tan jumpsuit and it comes all the way down and it has like these slit bottoms, which I hate. Ugh, I hate when they have these slit bottoms all the time. Like, But other than that, I super love the color. I love the style of the jumpsuit. Only thing I also don't like about Shein sometimes is like the sizing. Certain things fit weird. I wish it was a different material, if you know what I mean. Like certain materials, the sizing is off. And the try on, you can kind of see that it looks bigger than it should be. It's a small, so it should fit like completely tight, but it doesn't, which is annoying. But it's so cute, you know? Hopefully after a few washes and stuff, it will get smaller. Super cute. So this next dress I got because I was keeping in mind like the club. I'm going to Lance on Friday and I know at some point I'm gonna be in the club and I definitely need more club cute outfits um, in general. So I have this gray dress right here. Hard to show on screen, but I'm gonna be wearing it over here so you can really see what it looks like. But it's super cute, under boob vibe and it comes with a skirt and then the whole back is out. Yeah, it's tight, I like the material. This is the type of material I meant like I would like on my jumpsuits. Yeah, other than that, it's not much else to say about it. It's super cute. So that's all my dresses. So now onto shorts. These shorts, these are just leather shorts. Um, they have pockets on the back. I like them, but I don't like how they're big in the front. These are supposed to be extra small and they're not extra small at all. They, these are probably like a small, pushing medium 
they fit around the waist and stuff but the front part of it is a little baggy and i hate that i was trying to replace i had some shorts like this from pretty little thing and i was trying to replace them but the pretty little thing ones definitely fit way better around the front crotch area i hate when it looks like you have a baggy crotch it looks disgusting yeah so i cannot stand that so yeah so i don't know how i feel about the shorts they still fit so like maybe they can work with certain outfits but i don't know I finally used a pair of black denim shorts for myself. Uh, these also fit kind of weird, even though they are small, but they fit better than the leather shorts do for sure. I could definitely wear these for a little bit before it gets too cold at school. Um, so yeah, these are just a staple. You need some shorts, so yeah. My last pair of shorts are these light wash blue shorts. I have some that are a little darker wash blue, but I love, love, love these shorts, how they fit. Like, that's a weird thing about Shein too. Like some stuff, you'll get the exact same thing. And this fits better than this. Doesn't make any sense, but I love these shorts. I love the type of denim they use. I love how it fits. It's like booty shorts, but not too booty shorts. I love these shorts so much. So yeah, that's it for my shorts. Moving on to top. So for my first shirt was this like mesh see-through shirt. And it covers your boobs, that's where the patches are. But it looks super, super, super cute in real life. Um, I wish it was a bodysuit. I feel like that would have just ate more. But the fact that it's a crop top, that works too, I guess. I was planning on wearing this as well. It's like a night out type of vibe. Yes, I really, really like this shirt. My next shirt that I got that I absolutely love, I literally waited until it came back in stock to buy my cart, is this crop top and it's tied up like this and it's see-through but on it doesn't look see-through for some reason i would definitely if i go out in this i'll probably for sure wear um nipple pads but this shirt just gives me like jean paul gautier inspired vibes like i think that's what they're trying to get and it gives that to me like the, but i really like the colors and stuff too so i really like how it fits too i love everything about this shirt so I will definitely be wearing this this upcoming school year going out. My next shirt is definitely super hard to show on camera, but it's this bodysuit with cutouts on it. And I actually was very hesitant to get this because I'm like, I don't know how it's gonna look on me, but I actually really, really like this. This is definitely another going out shirt for sure. And the sleeves are like mesh. I like this shirt a lot, surprisingly. I don't know, it's cute. You need like for the club and stuff, you need really cute like stuff you wouldn't ordinarily wear like on a normal night out going to dinner or something. So I feel like this is like definitely for the club or going out to bars and stuff like that. Yes, I really like this shirt. Okay, my next shirt. So I saw a girl wearing this on TikTok a while ago and I have had it in my wish list because I've wanted this shirt so bad. This is this shirt and it's like a corset type of vibe. And it's leather and it's green. And honestly, it looks kind of cheap to me. Maybe I just need it to grow on me. I don't know. Now, green gives fall vibes. So I'll definitely probably be wearing this um, later in the fall. Like, my last item of the day is this white corset top. I, I like this shirt, but I feel like the corsetness, it's supposed to snatch your waist in, but I feel like it doesn't have that effect on me for some reason. Still a cute shirt though. But I feel like it doesn't really snatch my waist in, maybe because it's like a short, I don't know. I paired it with the blue jeans in the little try on video, so I really like it. I'm definitely probably going to go back and get the black. They have a whole bunch of different colors, but I definitely want the black version of this shirt as well. Okay guys, so that's all of my items that I picked up this past week. Uh, I have a lot of back school clothes, but I also have a lot of like going out clothes, so yeah, it's like a good mixture of all of them if you guys enjoyed this video all of my stuff that i got from shein will be linked down below but the stuff i bought in person i'll definitely try to look for those links for you guys if i do i'll have it marked in the description as well um yeah so other than that if you like this video please like comment subscribe down below um and i will see you guys in my next video which will be very soon i'm not gonna leave for another year again so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I love you guys. Yeah. Yeah. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit.